So one of these is a 4700. Forty-seven hundred plus should go in like so, and Of course, it shifted or did it? No, it didn't. I just thought it did. We'll flow this side, get a good solder joint. We'll come back and reflow this side just because we can because it did move around a bit. Two sixty eight hundred I'm guessing these are not Nishikon. They may be. They typically be marked, so now it is what it is. It's got positive marked down here. Or 6800 I mean it's got positive labeled here so again we've talked about this in other videos but there's markings on the cap usually the usually the white stripe indicates negative in this case it's got negative symbols in it so it does the short lead is typically negative as well long lead is typically positive so you've got indication and, and, and a physical difference to help guide you there's a plus side down here So I've got the positive lead towards the plus sign. I wish I'd have taken pictures of all these caps. I forgot before I started removing them. It is what it is. bulk filter caps in. There's definitely more room there for airflow. These were much tighter, you know, in place. I may actually want to hot snot those just because they didn't push down flush or as flush as I would have liked. I'm not going to straighten them up. They're fine, but uh, we've got the new ones here. Do a bit of a sort. We've got 47. We're trying to roll off. 47. Forty-seven. And forty-seven. And as I recall, there was four forty-sevens. One, two, three, and four. Put these back in the bag so I don't lose them. So I've got a 47 there and the same things, so the markings and the leads. And there's a plus on the silk screen. Lead wise, spacing doesn't match, but that's okay. 47 here. Again, there's positive mark on the silk screen. For these two, the positive is opposite direction of the first two I put in. 47. 
seven. I'm not pushing these down flush to the board because it would stress the leads and I don't want to stress the leads and break a seal and have them leak. That wouldn't make me happy. It's just a day for the flux. Smoked and up straight in my face. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. And I dropped one of the leads. Make sure it's not on the board. So let's see, positive is correct, positive is correct, positive is correct, positive is correct. I've now got two in here, I've got a 2.2, no I've got two, I've got a one microfarad and a 4.7, let's check the bag. So there's a 4.7 50 volt. And a one microfarad 50 volt. And these have all been 105 degrees C caps looking at them. Which is nice. That'll give them a little longer life. Actually a lot longer life potentially, depending on how much heat there is. So I've got a 4.7. 4 which was up high. So that's this one. And I've got a one microfarad. And you are labeled one, correct? One at 50 volt. Plus is up. Obviously, if you're more comfortable doing it one cap at a time, you certainly can do that. You know, I've got the Sam's PhotoFact for the drive. I've got lots of printouts, but, you, know, you know, schematics and things. So I wasn't too worried. If I got completely lost, I'd be able to go back and reference other material to figure out what cap went where. Good enough. It's not perfect, but it is good enough. I've got one up here that's a 2.2. That's 47. This then must be the 2.2, and my god, is it tiny. 2.2. Uh, positive is up. Yeah, the, the replacement cap kit for the Atari 800 was, was beautiful. The cap, you know, the lead spacing and everything matched, and it went very well. Uh, this kit isn't quite as nice, though, you know, can't say that the lead spacings on the original caps matched. They really didn't, you know, the board, so... Still can't complain, it's nice to have them all in one kit. And we've got one over here that was a 4.7, and this is there a decimal point or is that 47? I am not sure. I'd hate to think I've got this, has got it's got to be 4.7 based on the size, but we'll measure it. 4.7, okay, 4.48 microfarads, close enough. 
close enough. So the plus is down. Goes in this orientation. We've replaced all the caps. Just you know, take a close look for orientation. Positive is positive, 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 and positive, positive, positive. Yep, orientation on them all looks good. I don't know if I bent this test point pin, but I'm going to straighten it back up. Uh, actually, there was one test point pin in here someplace that had a uh, hot snot on it, but that's fine. I think we can call that all good. 